you don't really need a big fire for this. And the way I do it is I I heat the compression side, the side that I know it's going to be in compression when I bend it. See if you can see it has not been straightened yet. Zoom in on that. frame here. same time that I'm straightening. I have to be careful with reed because it, it only bends so far before it, it cracks or splits. It's not like uh, wood shoots where you can bend it quite a bit before it'll break. The reed has a very limited bending radius. There it goes. It has a very limited bending radius. So you can see how easily that that split. The reed is actually very thin at that point. It's just all part of the process. We'll try again. <laughs> 